Party's starting now. No jerks allowed. Oh my god, it's free. Oh, it's nice. It's yeah, that is pretty nice. Hey, what's happening? But you guys with guitars, who are you? My name's Adam Stryker. This is uh, my accomplice, Matt Russo. So, let's put a new band together called, uh, it's called Adam Stryker and the Amphetamines. And um, we've actually, we've only been together for about a month. A month or two. <clears throat> we played our first show at Maxwell's at nice. um, the end of October. And, uh, yeah, we thought we might, you know, come down here and spread the word a little bit. Awesome. But Steve, the Molotov Cocktails bass player, uh, is is playing with us, and then Matt and his twin brother John. Uh, John's a drummer. It was pretty interesting for us because, as you know, my brother and I, we've got another a band we have for a while. We've always kind of been in a similar circuit as the Molotov Cocktails. So I mean, we were talking even uh, co close to ten, yeah, ten years ago. We actually, Adam, not the Molotov co Cocktails, but Adam. And us, we both played at battle, battle, battle bands. bands and and our, yeah, and he it, was, and he's like thirty years younger than me. So <laughs> he, was like, he was like twelve years old, literally. The first yeah, time I hadn't hit puberty yet. And he was just <laughs> had, so he was he, a little guy. Yeah, yeah. I had like a real bad acne. And, <laughs> <laughs> um, I was very clean looking, but had an extremely high pitched voice. <laughs> Anyways, I mean, the whole th it's weird that we've ended up playing together now. After, you know, it's kind of like a, it's been a like a circle but it's a full circle yeah <laughs> as they say uh, we have something coming up next week uh, a week from tonight actually at a place called Nick's in Newark we're having a hard time getting people to commit to going to Newark we're a little little frightened of Newark but it's actually <laughs> in a nice area um, a lot of people don't even know that there are nice areas in Newark. there is yeah. but there certainly are <clears throat> it's it's over by uh, NJ Pack and okay. uh, the Prudential Center it's called Nick's Bar we're going to be playing there with a band called Science. They're kind of new. They're really good guys. And um, who else is on that show? And our good buddy Joel Harmon. Mm -hmm. uh, we go way back. We used to be in a band with him. So uh, that, should, that should be a good time. We're going to clean up at Nick's Bar in Newark. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and we literally have to clean up. When we're <laughs> in exchange for playing. Yeah. Do uh, wait tables and <clears throat> Yeah, lock up at, at night. It's rough. It's a pretty rough gig. <laughs> but at our Maxwell show, we you know we did that, and then the drums just kind of were keeping a beat, and I was like, oh yeah, you guys are gonna do this song, and then they started singing along, and then I walked off stage and went to the bar. <laughs> I was planning on getting four beers for the whole band. Right. But by the time I got to the bar, I was like, this is taking forever. <laughs> and they couldn't see well, me. Yeah. They were like, like the, the, the way the thinking? room is configured, you can't see the bar from the stage, and so we're all like. Dude, Adam left me. <laughs> quit the band. We're like, it's his band. How can we quit? Now, did everybody keep singing and playing through the whole thing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But we uh, we weren't sure where he went. And then he came back with a beer, and he was like, wasted. And we're like, <laughs> no, I'm just kidding, but he, he only had a beer for himself, though. So yeah, and they were pissed. They were, and that's when they stopped playing. They were like, oh, I can get us a beer? And then, and then we almost broke up. But yeah, I, wound up, I wound up buying them, you know, a case after the show. Yeah. <laughs> so um, any plans to do any recording? Yes, actually. Um, we're supposed to be doing drum tracks tomorrow, but we don't know if his brother's alive. Yeah, yeah no, right, right now we're going through the challenges of trying to figure out when we could record. Yeah, you know, <clears throat> when you have a job... <laughs> really <laughs> professional, Matt. <laughs> Is your phone on now? You should you should yeah. call him. I'm concerned. If yeah. there are any drummers out there, you can call in. What's the number? Seven three two nine three two eighty eight hundred. Adam Striker and the Amphetamines needs a new drummer. That's right. The eighty eight point seven caller will be the new drummer. <laughs> yeah, exactly. yeah. <laughs> and the lines are lighting up. I got a haircut today. Um, he thought I was going to be on television, so he got it. <laughs> yeah, I did a freestyle about Rocky earlier, but I don't know if I'd be able to recapture it. Mm.